Greetings and salivations, everyone. I'm Krista. This is Fisher, and welcome to Sea Rad. Today we've got an inflatable Grogu to review, so stay tuned. Sea Rad. Hi, everybody. Well, hello, 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 everyone. Welcome. We hope everyone's doing totally rad today. We've got my latest Five Below find to review today, and it is this inflatable Grogu. How super cute, guys. I hope it works the way we want it to. So we're going to take it out of the package. We're going to blow it up. I'll show you its details up close. And of course, we will rate it on our scale of totally bad to totally rad. So, Fisher, before I set you to the side, I know you want to show everybody your new hat, right? <laughs> yes, Fisher has a new hat because one of the times we're going to Disneyland in April is on Dapper Day weekend. So, he wanted to get a little dapper hat. This is only part of his outfit, guys, so you'll just have to wait and stay tuned for that. But, Fisher, I am going to have to set you to the side now. Are you good with that? I'm good with that. Alright, little dude. Boop. We will see you in a little bit. So Five Below finally has some new Grogu merchandise. They have a little, it's like a cosmetic kit. I think it's mostly lip glosses that's new. But one of the items that they have on their website and in stores, an inflatable Grogu. How super cute is he, guys? He is supposed to be 24 inches tall. And he does have a little hang hole at the top, so when you blow him up, you can hang him from somewhere if you are so inclined. So yeah, let's get him out of the package, take a good up close look at him, and then we're going to blow him up so you guys can see how he looks. Ready? There he is out of the package, guys. He is a pretty good size. I will say his coat that is supposed to be like a tan color is more of like a greenish tan color. So it's not quite screen accurate on the colors, but he's got the pink in his ears. He's got cute little hands, but looks like no feeties, guys, but there does look like there's a hard disc in the bottom, so when you blow him up, he should, in theory, stand on his own. I wanted to mention he is a vinyl rubber. He also comes with a little vinyl repair patch, and on the package, there are instructions on how to use that repair patch. So do not throw this little piece of paper away. That's your repair patch, and do not throw the instructions away unless you already are an expert at them. But let's take this guy and go get him blown up. And there he is, blown up, guys. I have the best hubby in the whole wide world. I didn't want to mess up my lipstick, so I took it in. I was like, Conrad, can you blow this up for me? And he did. I did ask him when he was blowing it up. It does not have one of those little stoppers inside of it. So if you're blowing it up and you have to stop in the middle and take a break, the air does come out, so you have to kind of cover it with your finger. It is just the one blow up, and then here is the hanger. I thought there was two little pegs on the back of him. But one was the hanger, so I was confused there. He does have the hard bottom, and I did try him out. Check it out, guys. He does stand by himself. And I'll come around to the side so you can see that, no, he's not leaning up against anything. But how super cute is he? He is about two feet tall, so he's a pretty big dude. And look at the face. Oh, so adorable. Again, the arms blow up, the body blows up, no feeties on him. They, they could have put little feeties here, and that would have helped him even stand better. But super, super cute and adorable. As I mentioned, I got him at five below. He was $5. I had to have mine shipped because unfortunately my local store didn't have these in stock. But if you have a five below near you, check it out. I will put the link to it in the description of the video for you. But super adorable dudes so rating this on our scale of totally bad to totally rad well since i just blew him up and i won't know you know how long he's gonna be before he starts deflating on his own 
I am going to call him a totally rad for right now. He's a super thick vinyl material, so he's not real thin like the stuff you get at like the Dollar Tree. So I have good good feeling that he may last a little while before he starts to leak out of his back section here. But right now he is a totally rad i'm gonna let him sit overnight and if there's any updates on him like if he's deflated at all i will let you know in the end of this video but what do you guys think about him do you think he's super cute like i do he's really really cool <laughs> but Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more awesome and totally rad things in the future, please subscribe to our channel and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss seeing us. And I guess there's only one thing left to say, right, little dude? We'll see you later.